I think the first thing that captured me when I came to Wales was the wildness of the land. You know, in so many places the spirit's been completely trampled out of the ground, but it seemed like there was still magic in the woods and the fields and the animals. As a city girl and former radio talk show host, this raw, rough kind of life was a million miles from where I started. Going from a, having a maid in San Francisco to learning to cook supper for 10 people around the farmhouse kitchen table in Wales was a huge shock to my system. I painfully, slowly learned to make bread and cheese and beer and soap and jam and believe me, I had plenty of disasters and mistakes along the way. Rich is like a Welsh crocodile dundee. He's a sharpshooter, a master craftsman, genius with wood and metal. And he has the gentlest heart of anyone I've ever met. Children always fall in love with him straight away, and I did too. I think it was the harshness of farm life that really took me by surprise. Hay is heavy. Mud is a constant reality. I spent a lot of time coated with mud up to my knees. Learning to milk a goat sounds great, but it reduced me to tears every night until I finally figured it out. I've never worked so hard. I had never loved so much or cried so much. I'd never been so frightened or so tired or so happy. I guess I'd never before felt so passionately alive. When Rich contracted a life-threatening antibiotic resistant infection and the doctors couldn't help us, I was just determined that having come so far and finally, finally found my happy ending, it was not gonna end like this. So I turned to the things that I'd learned on the farm. The natural magic, the healing power, the wild strength of the elements and the healing probiotics that I found on the farm. I got out my biggest farmhouse kitchen pan and all my essential oils and I set to work. What happened next is the subject of my diary and of the book, Secrets of Chuckling Goat, how a herd of goats saved my family and started a business that became a natural health phenomenon. I hope you enjoy this story. I hope that it accompanies you on your own healing journey. We send it with love to your family from ours.